Redneck007 here. Okay. Yes, I'm watching PewDiePie. Sue me. I don't care. Uh, honestly, PewDiePie, I'm going to tag you in this. I challenge you to a fight. Bare knuckles. Hell, I don't Fisticuffs. That's right. We're going to throw down. Sweet science. Thing is, good me, me. Make a fight out of you. You catch yeah. that chicken, you can do anything. You're a rock, kid. You're a rock. <laughs> He's a bum. <laughs> Beauty Pie's a bum. Don't let him speak to you like that, kid. Get in there and shout his boss. So, anyway, Beauty Pie. You Swedish bikini model, I challenge you. I challenge you. I will come to you. I will come to your, not your homeland, because I think you live in the UK. Guess what? I'll be over there sometime next year, buddy. And um, I'll put up a dollar if you pay me uh, two dollars. I challenge you a dollar for two dollars, U.S. U.S. dollars. Hell, I'll have some euros. I got euros. I challenge you one euro to two euro that I win the boxing match. I will have one hand tied behind my back. And I will get no training from no professional fighters like oh, uh, Logan, Logan and Logan. Or KSI. Matter of fact, after Logan Paul whooped your ass, KSI, I want some of you. I'm being serious. <coughs> You're going to say, oh, but you were... Hold on, let me see if I can do your accent. Oh, no, hold on. Yeah. Okay, so I can't do your accent. I don't watch you enough. You're going to say, oh... But you are American who uh, who was trained by the United States Army. You're damn right I was. Thing is, it doesn't matter. Like, I'm disabled. I mean, I won't fight KSI with two uh, one hand tied behind my back. Matter of fact, PewDiePie, back to you. I will have two hands high behind my back and I will box you with my nose. I will peck you to death. Like a... You know what I'm saying? I will fucking cockfight you. I'm being serious, people. PewDiePie. I will knock that smile. No, you know what? I can't say that because they'll say, oh, you're cyberbullying. YouTube will send me an email. You're cyberbullying. No, I'm a challenging. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not trying to bully anybody. I'm trying to win two euros. <laughs> I mean, if I have to act like Donnie Bear. Hmm. Get it! Pie. <clears throat> Hold on. Hey. Pie is Donnie Bayer. I swear to God. I will fuck you up with Ronda Rousey's pussy. Sorry, Ronda Rousey. I don't like you anyway. I didn't like you in the Expendables. And boycott Hollywood. Fuck Hollywood. But... Hey, I like Donnie Baker. What can I say? You know, I was listening to him on fucking Bob and Tom before the damn YouTubes. Like, he was funny before the YouTubes, but he's even funnier when you can see him, you know, fucking, I don't know, blowing imaginary fucking bugs out of his face or, I don't know, maybe his mom smoked real close to him as a child. I don't know. But one thing is for sure, PewDiePie, you do not make me laugh. 
how in the hell you got so many uh, subscribers, I'll never know. <coughs> but honestly, you put out a video, do you get 63 million views? No, you don't. So, I think PewDiePie bought a bunch of subscribers. Well, I don't buy shit. <laughs> Except antibiotics when I get an STD. No, I'm just kidding. I just don't go get checked. <laughs> it works out fine. Mountain mama, take me home. I'm kidding. Look at, the, look at her face over here. She's like, oh, God. There went my chance getting any ass tonight. I'm just kidding. There's always prophylactics. What the fuck is that? What does that even mean? I don't know. <laughs> Place where I belong. West Virginia. Mountain mama. Okay. I sound better when I'm at the Harris Cherokee in the fucking shower. So, uh, yeah. There you go, PewDiePie. You know, I started my whole channel premises on making fun of you. And you flagged some of my videos and I'm a little pissed off about it. So I challenge you to a bare knuckle out one hand tied behind my back. You might even, you know, you got a longer reach than me. Like you got them spaghetti arms. I mean, like you ought to buy stock in ramen noodles. And honestly, you know, you put out these stupid videos that say uh, 100 million fucking billion trillion sextillion percent not laugh. But you're the one who's laughing at all this garbage. The shit ain't funny. You want me to show you something fucking funny? You're fucking staring at it. Anyway, PewDiePie, I challenge you. I challenge you. Hell, I challenge you to the game of checkers. <laughs> I'll whoop your ass in some checkers. <laughs> I'll give you two kings to start off with. <laughs> that ain't the PBR talking. I tell you what it is. <laughs> I challenge you. <laughs> you want to play a game? <laughs> we'll play a game of fucking checkers. And then I'll whoop your ass with one hand tied behind my back. Hell, I play Chinese checkers. I don't even like it. Because it's made in China. Oh, anyway. Hey, how many of y'all wish that him and PewDiePie would just go ahead and go get a hotel room and fuck? <laughs> I, I told James that. He said, why do we need a room? <laughs> Specialist Ed Webb said, say, why, why, why would I need a room? Hell, I'd just bend him over on my checker table. <laughs> Smack his ass, kiss him on his cheek. You're not a little spoon. What are you talking about? <laughs> We're definitely I'm definitely not a little spoon. Well, you know, I do have that ED problem sometimes. I do get the Viagras from the VA. So, maybe Lil Spoon is accurate. At times. True story. They're all true. That's what I love. It's like, you're like, yeah. Yeah, I have no filter. And no FBI. I'm not talking about the, the dragons and the, the, the hermaphrodites, you know, stuff, all that good stuff, that stuff. Nope, nope, nope. No, but I am. But yeah, technically, I, I, mean, I, don't, I don't know. I don't know. So anyway, PewDiePie, um, your days as a YouTuber is over. Because Camunition, K-A-M-U-I-N-T-I-O-N, is ten times funnier than you. And uh, honestly, he deserves like ten million subscribers. Like I don't, I don't care who subscribes to me, who doesn't, because uh, in the end, when I die, I'm just going in the ground anyway. Ain't nobody going with me. But one thing about it is, 
I hope to catch that shit on video. Because I am a true vlogger. Like, honestly, this cracker right here from Kingsport, Tennessee. And no, I'm not racist, not prejudiced, nothing like that. And that right there is not hate. That is nothing but love, especially that one. They're all love. Squirrel. <laughs> there was a bomb threat at the Greek theater. That might be old news. But I'll tell you what's not old news. PewDiePie challenged you to a thumb wrestling competition. <laughs> and I'll use the thumb that I broke. Look at my finger. Two, three, four. <laughs> yeah, one, two, three, four. I declare a thumb war on your asshole. Sorry, I was in the army, people. So, uh, yeah. I mean, I'll let you pick sides. That, it don't matter. I know. <laughs> like, it don't matter. I will let you pick what side you want, Pewdie Pies. Cutie Pie. Cutie Pie. It kind of is, but then again, it. And, uh,. You know, Ryan Up Church, I know you might watch Listen, Cutie Pie and all that. But honestly, he did say Americans were stupid in one of his videos. And it turned me off. It turned me off like a gay hooker with a broke wrist. Ain't nothing wrong with being gay, though. I mean, I don't condemn. I don't judge. I don't condone. And I don't own it. But, uh, you know, it is what it is. I know a lot of gay gay dudes. I know a lot of gay women. Hell, I know a lot of... Uh, I know a lot of gay service members. And there ain't nothing wrong with that. I mean, you know, but you ain't gonna come, like, butt punch somebody... Uh, I mean, I don't know. I don't know what the new. I don't know what the kids are calling these days. You know, used to be packing fudge and butt pirate and smoking pole. I mean, you know. I mean, it it, it might be called poking hole. I don't know. I don't know. But PewDiePie one thing's for certain. <laughs> I'm serious. I will knock you out with my fucking nose. And I'm not bullying you. I'm just trying to. <laughs> Like trying to be non aggressive, and he's like, I'll do it the least way possible. Yeah, I just fucking swat you like that. Swat you down like a fly. Right? Then I'm gonna call Donnie Baker and go back. Huh? He said he's gonna do it. I swear to God, he did. He said he's gonna do it. He said, he said he's gonna do it, Pew Pie. You, 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 you should have believed him the first time. I swear to God, he did. I'll say it straight to his face. Anyway, this has been Redneck 007 challenging PewDiePie, KSI, and hell, anybody else. Let's fucking get it on. I challenge you to a fucking one-legged dance competition. I challenge you to a crab walk. Dude, that's like, that actually sounds fun. I will challenge you to a fucking skipping rope competition. I'm not scared to lose. I've been a loser my whole life. I got the big L. What is even happening on here on YouTube? Okay, well, anyway, I'm going to get back to watching PewDiePie. Okay, like national. Ah, yeah, well, you know, it's like Sun Tzu said. Know thy enemy. That's really all I know. I really did read that whole damn book, and that's really all I got out of it. Um, actually, I didn't read the book. I read, I read the Cliff Notes. I used to have it somewhere. But, uh, Drake! Um, Little Wayne, I challenge you to a skateboard competition! <laughs> so can I! I can airwalk! I can ollie. Who else could I challenge?
Travis Pastrana. I challenge you to nothing because you probably beat me in everything we do. So, uh, yeah. With that being said, Chuck Norris. Chuck Norris. Dude, I, challenge I challenge you to a total gym workout. <laughs> but you had to bring the total gym because I give mine away. True story. Oh, goodness. Tim Kennedy. Yes, Tim, I'm calling you out. I challenge you to a long range target acquisition contest. But you're going to win because I can't even get near a firearm because I grew some marijuana in the state of Tennessee and now I'm a felon. So you win. There you go. Tennessee sucks. Ryan up, church. Ryan. Hope to see you at the Cotton Eye Joe's pretty soon. But I challenge you to a four-wheeler wheelie contest, but you had to help me out with a four-wheeler because I don't have one no more because I had to sell it because I was behind on my truck payment. But, uh, yeah. So I challenge all that and more. Redneck 007. David's got to go to work in the morning, so I got to shut up now. Like, my dick sucker has got to close. <laughs> So we're gonna whisper. We're gonna whisper. I thank you, Trump. I challenge you to divorce to divorce Jared Kushner and marry me. Donald Trump would love me as a son-in-law. I'm gonna go to Turkey for him if he lets me. Hell, I hope he puts me in the space force. All right, but anyway, people, I got to go. Redneck 007, hey, I just wanted to bring you, you know, a little entertainment because we all know cable sucks. So, uh, yeah, and if you like this shirt, redneckNationGear.com, go get you one today. I went to the VA today, and I had so many compliments on it. And uh, when somebody's like, oh, I really like that shirt, I was like, yeah, I'm trying not to uh, offend anybody. Sorry if it offended you. And they just laugh even more. And it was the doctors, the nurses. It was the staff. Just about everybody in that facility complimented me on my shirt. Uh, even the valet when I pulled up was like, nice shirt, man. I dig that. I was like, heck yeah. Thank you very much. All that good stuff. So, Redneck007 on the YouTube. Check me out. And if you want to hit me up on the Instagram, uh, redneck 713 fox on the Instagram. And uh, if you want to hit me up on the Twitter, it's like goldman007, old, you know, old call sign. So, uh, yeah, I'll catch you all on the Army side of life. And hopefully everybody's doing well, being happy, and loving yourself. That's where it starts, where it takes Backwoods Nation, check them out. Backwoods Bow Ties, that's a great family. Check out We All Matter Swing. That's Sierra Whiskey Alpha November Golf. We All Matter, and uh, you know, like, hey, this feller, oh Swing, he, he's just a good old, just a good old dude, like a good old boy from Kentucky. You know, doing it right. Just. It, it, He's just doing it right. And, uh, hey, Ryan Up Church, I was just kidding about the wheelie contest, but if you ever want to get together and ride four-wheelers, I'm retired, just let me know. And I would love to come up there because last thing I would do would be videoing anything or Snapchat and be like, G -g look who I'm with. But uh, I think it is awesome, you know, that what you're doing. And, hey, wish you the best, brother. Because I'm a fan for life. Hands down, uh, shout out to Redneck Nation, Bobby Nacklicky, Hillbilly Sean Hammonds, Megan Hammonds. Love y'all. Y'all stay safe. Y'all stay blessed. And uh, this Redneck 007 is signing out. I'm gonna get me another PBR. Watch me some PewDiePie, and just hopefully, hopefully, I get some kind of response or backlash or some haters out of this. I need some haters. So, without further ado-do, this has been Redneck007.
coming live from Redneck 007's residence. I'm out, people. God bless America. God bless our troops. Support our troops. Remember the fallen. And rest in peace, brothers. I'm out. Oh.